Praise the Lord, praise the Lord, and welcome to Shawnee's Prayer Podcast, Season 2, Episode 5. You can find this podcast on your favorite podcast forum. Don't forget to subscribe, download, comment, like, and share. Don't keep Shawnee's Prayer all to yourself. Allow it to be a blessing to someone else. So tell your family, tell your friends, tell your co-workers, tell your haters, tell your associates, Tell everyone about Shawnee's Prayer. You can find Shawnee's Prayer every Tuesday and Thursday. And as always, I start my prayer off with a blood scripture. Coming from Romans chapter 5 verse 9. Much more than being now justified by his blood, we shall be saved from wrath through him. Let's go to the throne of grace. Father God, I just want to say thank you. I just want to say thank you, Father God. Through it all, Father God. Despite it all, Father God. I just want to say thank you, Father God. Life is not always easy. Life is not always fair. But Lord, I just still want to thank you, Father God. I want to thank you for life, oh God. In the name of Jesus, oh God. Thank you, Father God, for allowing me to be in my right state of mind, Father God. Thank you for my family on today. Thank you for my friends and my church family, Father God. Thank you, Father God, for my supporters, Father God. In the name of Jesus, Father God, Lord God, I come and ask you to look down upon each and every person, Father God, who has been impacted by that storm, Father God, barrel, O God. In the name of Jesus, O God, look down upon those who are still in the path, Father God, of being uh, impacted by barrel, Father God. I pray for those who have no power, Father God, in the name of Jesus, Father God. I pray for those, Father God, in the name of Jesus, who may not have food to eat, Father God, who may not have water to drink, Father God, in the name of Jesus, Father God. I pray for those who may have missing loved ones, oh God, in the name of Jesus. I pray for those who have, may have missing pets, Father God, in the mighty name of Jesus. Lord God, I pray for your mercy and your grace, Father God, upon, Father God, every country, upon every state, Father God. God that has been impacted by this storm, Father God, in the name of Jesus, Father God. Lord God, I pray for each and every um state, Father God, that has been impacted, Father God, by these warm days, Father God. These overly warm days, Father God. These extremely hot days, Father God. These extremely humid days, Father God. I pray, Father God, that everyone has adequate air father god whether it's air conditioners father god whether it's central air father god in the name of jesus i pray father god for the senior citizens i pray for the senior saints father god in the name of jesus i pray for those father god who have disabilities father god i pray father god for those who have physical handicaps father god i pray for those who have breathing problems father god whether it's asthma tuberculosis copd emphysema father god congestive heart failure father god in the name of jesus father god lord god i pray for those who may have lupus father god in the name of jesus oh god so i pray father god in the name of jesus father god that you will cover each and every person father god in the name of jesus all those who have to work outside in the heat father god in the humidity father god in the name of jesus father god please father god keep each and every person from having a heat stroke father god in the name of jesus father god please allow everyone to have adequate father god liquids father god don't allow anyone to die father god from dehydration father god in the mighty name of jesus lord god i just pray and ask you father god to remember each and every person father god upon this land you know all that we're going through you know all that we're dealing with father god some people are dealing with a lot of Father God, they are on overload, Father God, in the name of Jesus, Father God. Someone is about to be burnt out, Father God, in the name of Jesus, because they have so much going on in their lives, Father God. Lord God, I just pray in the name of Jesus that you will be our strength. I pray in the name of Jesus that you will be our health and our continence, Father God. I pray that you will be our shield and our buckler, our fortress, Father God. I pray that you will be our refuge, Father God. I pray that you will be our shelter in a time of storm, oh God. I pray that you will be 
our way maker, our provider, our supplier of every good thing that we need, Father God. Lord God, make ways out of no way, Father God. Open up doors, Father God, that no man can close, Father God. And close the doors that should not be open unto us, that no man can open, Father God. In the name of Jesus, oh God, help us to walk in your ordinances, Father God. Help us to walk in the light, Father God, in the name of Jesus. Help us, Father God, to walk in your word, Father God, in the name of Jesus, oh God. Lord God, help us to know, Father God, that we have to believe in all of your word. We can't pick and choose what we believe and how we believe, Father God. If we're going to be Christians, we have to believe it all, Father God, in the name of Jesus, oh God. If we're Christians, we have to believe in God, the Father, God, the Son, and God, the Holy Ghost, oh God. We can't separate the Trinity. We can't separate the triune Godhead, oh God, in the name of Jesus, oh God. Oh, Father God, in the name of Jesus, oh God. I just pray in the name of Jesus, Father God, asking your Father God to help us, Father God, to make it, Father God. Help us, Father God, not to backslide, Father God. And if anyone is backslider or have backslidden, Father God, I pray that you will draw them back to the cross, Father God. I pray for anyone that may be in any form of lifestyle, doing anything that's not pleasing in thy sight, that's not giving your glory, that's not giving you honor. I pray that you will deliver them, Father God, no matter what it is. It could just be from gluttony, Father God. It could be from envious or just being jealous, Father God. It could be from anger, Father God. It could be from lying or stealing. It doesn't matter what the lifestyle is, Father God. If it does not give your glory, if it does not give your honor, it doesn't matter who says what, Father God. If your word says it's wrong, then it's wrong. If your word says it's right, then it's right, Father God. It doesn't matter what preacher preach what, Father God. In the name of Jesus, Father God, we have to remember, Father God, preachers are still human, Father God. Preachers get in the flesh, Father God. But I pray, Father God, that each and every one of us, Father God, who have been called to speak your word, to preach your word, Father God, that we are that we walk by the Spirit. Spirit, Father God, so that we will not fulfill the lust of the flesh, Father God. Help us, Father God, to walk closely to you. Help us to be um, connected to you, Father God, strongly connected to you, so that we can truly hear from you, Father God, so that we don't say anything in the flesh, Father God, so we don't say anything that's against your word, Father God, in the name of Jesus, so that we won't lead anyone astray, Father God, in the name of Jesus, Father God. So, Lord, I just pray, Father God, for someone that's going through stress on today, y'all. Someone that's going through anxiety, depression, Father God, in the name of Jesus, Father God. Someone is like, God, if you don't step in, I'm not going to make it. God, if you don't step in, I'm going to take my life. God, if you don't step in, I'm going to turn around. I'm going to stop serving you. Lord God, step in for that person, Father God. Someone is saying, no matter how, what I pray, my prayers never come to pass. God never um, steps in for me. He never listens to me. Father God, I pray pray that you will uphold that person, Father God, by faith. I pray that you'll keep that person, Father God, in the palm of your hands, Father God. Keep that person from giving up, Father God. Keep that person from turning back, Father God, in the name of Jesus, oh God. Lord God, I pray, Father God, that you will renew us, Father God. I pray, Father God, that you will restore us, rejuvenate us, Father God, revitalize us, Father God. Lord God, in the name of Jesus, give us a deeper walk with thee. Give us a, a, a a deeper walk, Father God. Help us, Father God, to learn your word, Father God, in context, oh God. Help us, Father God, to know your word, Father God. Help us to preach your word in season and out of season, Father God. Help your word to stay in our mouths, Father God, in the name of Jesus. Help your word to stay in our mind and our thoughts, Father God, in the name of Jesus, Father God. Help us to go higher in thee. Help us to go deeper in thee, oh God, in the name of Jesus, oh God. Lord God, help us us, Father God, that when people see us, that they don't see us, Father God, but they see the light of Christ illuminating through us, Father God, that when we walk past people, Father God, they get saved, that when we walk past people, Father God, they get healed, they get delivered, they get set free free, Father God, in the name of Jesus, oh God, that when we walk past people, Father God, they feel the spirit of Christ, oh God, in the name of Jesus, they feel the anointing, Father God, of the Holy Ghost, they feel the Holy Ghost power, Father God, illuminating all for us, Father God, in the name of Jesus, Father God, and that that same power that's in us, Father God, will touch them, Father God, and make a way for them, Father God, and help them to get connected to you, oh God, in the name of Jesus, oh God, 
And I just pray for this land. I pray for this earth, oh God. I pray for everyone on this earth, oh God. I pray for everything we are dealing with, everything we are going through. Through, I pray that you help us to hold on. I pray, Father God, that you help us to stay prayerful, Father God. Help us to pray without ceasing. Help us to continue to praise your holy name. Help us to worship you. Teach us how to worship you in the beauty of holiness, Father God. Teach us how to worship you through our situations, Father God. Help us to worship you, Father God, regardless of what we are going through, Father God. Help us to worship you because you are due all the honor, the glory, and the praises, oh God. Help us to worship you, Father God, in the name of Jesus, from the, from the innermost part of our souls, Father God. Help us to worship you from within, not just with our mouths, Father God, but help us to worship you from our spirit, Father God, in the name of Jesus, oh God. Lord God, in the name of Jesus, take us higher in thee, oh God, in, our, in the spiritual realm, oh God. Take us higher, Father God, in our praise. Take us higher in worship, oh God. Take us higher in our prayers, Father God, and our prayer life, oh God, in the name of Jesus, oh God. And Lord, I thank you. Lord, I praise you. Lord, I honor you. Lord, I glorify you, Father God. Help us to seek you first, oh God, in your kingdom, oh God. Help us to seek you in your kingdom first, Father God. And know by faith and believe by faith everything we need, Father God, will be added unto us, Father God. But help us to seek you with all diligence, Father God, in the name of Jesus, Father God, help us to ask, to seek, and to knock, O oh God, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, I pray, amen, amen, and amen. God bless you, God bless you, and God bless you.